Man, man, oh man. Well, let's get done watching some of the post game here. Watching Aaron Boone talk and everything. Been sitting down, kind of just um, going through what had just happened. And man, um, I don't know, like there's been so many tough, excruciatingly tough losses. Obviously, blowing leads, this, that. I don't know. All I gotta say is, I guess, what's, which one's the worst one? I guess it's the next one. Like, tonight's the worst one. I mean, it's, I guess every, every game's so important. You're going less and less games now. Coming in eight games behind the Red Sox. Huge, huge four game set. Yankees go ahead, one zip. Montgomery gives you five and two thirds. Shut out. Ball to that. Here he is talking now. See my TV here. Yeah, I just saw a quote. He said he's still uh, stick to his stomach. About it, yeah. I mean, he's got no run support. It's however, however many games been now, gets one run today, then they end up uh, blowing it. The lead, the one run lead later in the game, seventh inning or so. Uh, I can see Floreal, good young guy, but still has uh, kind of used to center field more. It's not a great center fielder as the, the, the sack fly tied up with the Red Sox. He was flat footed there instead of getting his momentum behind the ball to throw it home. And then, uh, obviously, we'll get, get to it later on, but the ball wasn't really there, backing up Gardner. In ninth, but let's see, it was 1 1. Yanks go ahead 3 1 no. Um With the uh, sack, with the little hit from Stan and the sack fly from Torres there. And I think it was the eighth inning. And look, 3 to 1, right? Uh, Cesar does a great, great job in the eighth inning to give you five pitches, three outs. Terrific job. Now, I don't really, people saying what leaves us in, I'm not about to leave Tessa in. I'm one of those people. Look, Chad Green, yeah, he's rested. This was his game to close. They mentioned it. It's his game, and he's got to go out there and shut the door down and get the job done. No question about it. Gets the first out and a breaking ball and strike out. And besides that, he's getting rocked with the fastball. And it's just, I don't know. There's just nothing to say. I mean, he's got rocked, rocked. Uh, then the two-run double there, whatever it was, tied the game up. Like I said, Gardner trying to make an effort for that ball. Ball was rocking one hops the wall, 4 L was late getting there and tied the game up. You get out of the inning eventually. Yanks get one run to go ahead, uh, 4 3 in the top of the 10th. Uh, with the sack fly uh, from Gardner. And then obviously, we all saw what happened. Krisky, 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 oh my, oh my. It was a great job yesterday getting the win. Lock pitcher in the mound. Today, not so much. It was it four wild pitches? Allows the tie, tie run to score, two wild pitches. Allows. Uh, Bill Gartz move up from, just from first to second, second to third. Wild pitches and then the sack fly. Gets Martinez strike, a nice strikeout, high fastball. And then he had Wilson start warm up. He could have walked Renfro and the next guy to load the bases, set up a t double play of one out. Instead, first pitch Renfro, fastball out of the plate. Ball on the right field, sack fly. Sox walk it off, Yanks to lose in just heartbreaking fashion. And it's just so many times you can. Go at least like five, six, just extremely heartbreaking loss this year. And uh, like I said, it's the next one. The next one today's, tonight's hurts. This hurts, hurts, man. I mean, all those, yeah, they hurt. But now tonight versus Red Sox in Fenway. Four game series, you got to take game one. And like like I said in the broadcast, posting here, the style they've been playing, the style they play today, what they've been playing the last couple, last week or so, uh, bunts, sack flies. Stolen bases, um, just, just good baseball. Uh, getting runs in, manufactured runs, only had four hits today. Had the four runs, but again, it wasn't really a four out and out today. It was the guys that have been on the team for a while, John Boy mentioned and stuff, or the guys on post team, whatever it was I saw. I think it was Stanton, it was uh, Odor, um, Torres, Mayhew. But uh, I looked to be doing this, so I did the whole week, got four wins in a row, but then uh, today, same style of play, but get walked off. And, um, yeah, it just, no other words, but just brutal. Brutal. <laughs> Dropping this game, heartbreaking fashion, game one. Got Garrett Cole on the mound tomorrow. Hopefully, he can give you another strong outing and bats give him some runs and, um, get, uh, Britain, Chapman back, see what happens in the bullpen. But, like I said, Prisky there. I don't know, like, Nelson last night. It's just, sucks. I mean, you got some guys like Sesta, other guys throwing really well. And some guys, tough positions. Obviously, uh, Chapman, uh, Britain didn't want to go back to back days. Oscar still, I can't go. But at the end of the day, Chad Green has to save that game. Just, you need to, man. Three outs, get the first out. Couldn't get it done. But oh well, uh, just tough. But Gary Cole on the mound tomorrow. He's going to look to even this series up at one. 
enjoyed today's video, please give it a like, leave a comment, subscribe, Michelle, and as always, let's go Yankees.